All right. Okay. Pradeep, glad to, thanks for taking some time to sit down and, and chat with me. So it's been a, a year since uh, LCA 2013 when we kicked off the, uh, they had the first formal meeting of the Lenaro Networking Group. How, how excited are you with the progress that the ARM ecosystem has made in the networking group here? Uh, th thanks, Bob, for uh, this chat. From an ARM eco perspective and Lenaro perspective, I think from us, Cisco's viewpoint where I said we have made a lot of progress. Uh, we started with two or three projects. Uh, one was a big project for us, which was Big Indian and delivering Big Indian. And Lenaro has delivered the Big Indian kernel, the Big Indian tool chain, and whatever we needed on Big Indian. And we are moving forward, starting to use the technology which uh, LNG or Lenaro have just produced. I know that was, a, that was an important project. For it, it was a very important project for us, and we are very happy that the project is delivered on time. The second important project for us is uh, ODP or Open Data Play. Right. Okay. And I think we had some teething trouble getting it kick started, okay. but I think it's getting online now okay, and on time. And one of the uh, deliverables for us for this year should be that when we meet next time either at LCU or LCA, we should be able to make the same comment about ODP and what, how successful ODP has been and who all is using ODP as I'm making about big ending today. Yeah, certainly our hope by then, of course, as you know, is we, we hope to have some a considerable amount of demonstrations, um, some applications rolling, and maybe even some proof of concept reference platforms by then. So yeah, I, I think the SOC vendors quickly adopting ODP is going to be our uh, basically whether we win or lose kind of thing. It will de it will right. depend on how quickly we can get yeah, reference, reference implementation. Ref reference impl not only reference implementation, but the shipping implementation, so that we can start shipping our right. platform on top of those SOCs. That's right. That's right. The um, what are your? I, I, I watched your your keynote and very interesting. You know, we've been we've been tracking Open Daylight and the Open Networking Foundation as well. These are big projects with all the major stakeholders in there. What's your feeling in terms of? how important it is that the open data plane project jacks into these projects and, and gets more connected and, and hopefully embraced by these bigger initiatives in the industry. So I think from LNG perspective, we need to do one of the two things. Yeah. If we look at LNG, uh, how LNG is formed and who the members are, okay, it have very limited number of uh, networking vendors. Mm -hmm. yeah. And when it comes to the adoption of ODP, Okay. Having a few networking vendors is going to be hard for us to go back and saying ODP is the standard, use ODP. Even though all the SOC vendors will use ODP, mm -hmm. it, it still becomes harder to say it's a de facto standard. And it will be good for us to either get more networking vendors in LNG okay, and get that wider ecosystem to support us, provide the input, uh, review the uh, APIs and all that kind of stuff. Right. And if we can't do that for some reason, probably it's a much faster approach might be for us that ODL is focused today on control plane. ODL is not doing anything for the data plane. That's right. And can we become a sister project for ODL and start work talking to ODL to say, can we bring in ODP into ODL and ODP becomes the embedded data plane abstraction for uh, networking and pretty much every networking vendor is there. So I think we need to look at uh, what do we do there. Yeah, I mean certainly uh, conversations that I've had with stakeholders in the Open Networking Foundation, for example, they have indicated based on the, you know, the descriptions that we've given on Open Data Plane, they've, they've said this, this is a problem that I think uh, it really needs a solution. So they're very excited to learn more about the about the Open Data Plane project and how it might, you know, fit in under and solve some problems uh, under that southbound API. Yeah, and I, and I think the first uh, work which we need to do, and I think some of the discussion has already started happening between ODL and ODP, is how we just take ODP as is, okay, and use the southbound interface from ODL and hook the ODP there. Okay, but I think. In my mind, that's just the beginning because at that point of time, we're just saying, look, ODP is one of the projects which is out there right. and it's using ODP uh, interfaces, southbound interfaces, as any other vendor will use. Mm -hmm. I think we will get a lot more value out of ODP if we took it to the next step and saying, look, OD ODL and OTP are going to become uh, partners 
work very close together mm -hmm. okay to evolve these two technologies technologies together and i think both of the, uh, the projects will um, benefit from it yeah I, I agree i think there's a lot of uh, value add that we can bring to those bigger initiatives uh, and uh, i'm anxious to get more engaged and spend more time collaborating and exploring that that opportunity because I think I, I personally believe there's a big opportunity yeah, there. and I think as uh, part of a steering group of uh, LNG we should figure out how to interact more close with ODL have some couple of uh, um, the sessions with them to right. understand whether there is a synergy or not okay yeah. because if we can build that synergy I think industry will win big time so what do you think are the big things that, that the Lenaro networking group and, and the ODP project should focus on in the coming months? I think as I said, uh, uh, my biggest concern about ODP project is not from an execution perspective, means execution will happen. If not today, three months down the line, mm -hmm. the software always takes a little bit longer than we think. There's certainly a lot of activity right yeah, now. There's a huge amount of activity growing, going growing, on. Growing and uh, the, uh, one thing I have learned, Software always takes longer than <laughs> what you think. We, we the timeline always shifts to the right, never to the left. Okay. <laughs> That's right. But I think the adoption is the biggest thing which we need to make sure. Okay. Right. That ODP is seen as the pro project, ODP is seen as the API which everybody is going to adopt to. And I think that is going to need much wider review in open source community. That's going to need much wider uh, engagement okay, from the networking vendor if you want to make it successful. Right, right. So, and, you know, it seems to me that one way to foster that uh, is to, you know, take a look at, you know, building these reference, the implementations on the SOCs, and also integrating some of the key, you know, modern virtualized network software stack. Uh, and trying to build proof of concepts or prototyping reference implementations. Uh, that, that, that's one way to do it means we can do all this stuff, take a lot of work which have been done in other open source project and bring it over, right. make sure that those open source project works and as more open source project work on top of ODP, ODP starts becoming de facto. Mm -hmm. But the other way also is, we have to do that, but the other way also is if we can get a few more networking vendors into LNG and then they, they will bring a different perspective. Okay. Sure. And sure. they will look at the API, they will look at the ODP, provide the other feedback which they, we need, and mm -hmm. that will be another way right. to get a wider adoption. You know, and it seems to me that one of the big benefits of, of working on reference implementations is a lot of people are wanting to see you know these SDN concepts implemented and, and really find out how well it's going to work and perform and scale. So mm -hmm. it does seem to me that that, that that's a part of the equation as well. Uh, and, and different implementations are given means, and I think the more code we can move over to ODP, okay, uh, in open source community, running code is better than anything else you can think of. Okay. And the more code we can port over ODP, more we can show that ODP can support other things. That's right. Yeah. Means there's <clears throat> nothing better than running code. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, I'm, I know I'm going to be spending a lot of my time this year evangelizing and, and getting other projects and other software stacks interested in trying out their software on the, on the ODT pro project as, as the deliverables, as the implementation start to roll out. Yeah. So I'm excited for the future. Uh, I'm, be I'm very excited and I'm really happy what LNG has achieved in a year means. Uh, for 2013, we got the big end and I'm hoping in 2014 we get ODP yeah. and I declare that a huge success right. for LNG. I agree. Yeah. Thanks. Yep. Good Thanks, Bob. Appreciate it.